Well, hello, Scott. I'm about coming to you live from Oahu. It's April 25th, 2015, Saturday morning, 8:45. Perfect day to talk about sales training. Now, I get a lot of questions from managers, and they always want to know, you know, uh, common questions that they, they have. Is one of them. One of the common questions is when should I fire somebody? And you know, there's there's a whole bunch of different reasons why somebody should be fired, and one of them is going to be insubordination. So, somebody who's not doing what they're supposed to. But the the more reason that they ask me that question is, when do I give up on somebody? When do I say, okay, I've given you everything that I can, and you're just not gonna you're not gonna do it? Okay. So here's here's my process of looking at at the time that you let somebody go from the sales process for whatever you're looking at. Let's say that you have a, a salesperson. Let's name him Jim. Jim's right here and you've taken him through your, your courses, he's been through the classes, you've given him everything that you can. You've given him the coaching, you've given him the capability, and Jim goes out on the field and you know he stumbles, he stumbles, he gets recorrected with coaching, he stumbles, he stumbles, he gets recorrected with coaching, and just for some reason it's not getting connected. Now, some industries that happens in a month, some industries that happens in three months, but you're gonna find that failure typically will lead to more failure without the right coaching. And if, if the manager isn't getting in there involved fast enough, it creates some challenges. And if you're a salesperson watching this, this isn't a time for you to be needy. This is a time for you to say, hey, look, I need help and I need to get some implementation done. And sometimes what salespeople will do, and this is the key for the managers, is they'll ask for the help and they get all sorts of help, but then they go out in the field and they don't do what they've been taught. So there is a small segment of the population, I'm gonna say about 10%, that are, uh, for lack of better terms, an absolute waste of time. They're, they're gonna go out there, they're gonna say they're gonna do what they're gonna do, they're, they're going to do what the process is taught, and then they don't do anything with it. That would be a time to let somebody go. Another time would be if they've got unethical behavior, they're doing stuff that's illegal, that's putting the company in a bad position, they can create some problems, they're selling people stuff that they don't need. Um, they're just creating a lot of issues for themselves and creating that, that, that noose that's gonna tighten up around their neck. And then, you know, so we got insubordination, not implementing, and then we got, you know, ethical issues. Those three things alone are big enough and should, should just say, hey, those are the warning signs, okay? So take a look at them. Just be patient with people. And if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below, leave a comment, question, or story, that'd be fantastic. To the right or to the left, there's a subscribe button. Subscribe and then send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, Scott Bell. Coming to you live from the North Shore of Oahu. We'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Aloha.